this year's inductee in the sports media category is James Beach. James went to Tyner High School, then up to the University of Tennessee in Knoxville. Says he wasn't much of an athlete in school, so out of Tyner he worked as a football manager, basketball scorekeeper, and a baseball statistician, and that high school sports is really what mattered to him. Roy Exum hired James at the News Free Press in 1981. I'd love to know, wouldn't even begin to guess, how many miles James has logged on the highways and in the air covering local, regional, and national athletic events like state championships, SEC championships, bowl games, Final Fours, even the Masters. James won numerous awards from the Tennessee Sports Writers Association, including Best Event Writer, Best Feature Writer, and Best Prep Writer. Was that you in a football stance? Wow, I'm impressed. His coverage was instrumental in luring the Volleyball State Tournament to our city, as well as getting Spring Fling to start here and stay here from 94 to 2002. James was and still is an excellent writer. I'd like to share a few lines that he wrote on Chattanooga.com a couple of weeks ago in reflecting on tonight's Hall of Fame selection. James said, I played golf with Chi Chi Rodriguez, walked a butler cabin with Jack Nicholas, wrestled with Bo Jackson on a baseball field, caught a pass from John Elway, spent a night flip, uh, sipping a few cold ones and talking baseball with Joe DiMaggio. He said, I've run through the tee with Coach Johnny Majors, drove Michael Jordan around town when he was here for a sporting event, drove Lindsey Nelson from Knoxville to see his daughter at Orange Grove, and man, those stories from that voice were legendary, to say the least. James left the newspaper in 2000 to get into public relations and marketing work, but he continued to provide prep coverage for the Times Free Press from 2010 to 17, softball games for Chattanooga.com while working in the uh, state system as a water treatment operator for Eastside Utility District. Ladies and gentlemen, he's even been a lobbyist. A lobbyist when he was the marketing director for the Car uh, Carpet and Rug Institute. But in spite of that, he can add Hall of Famer to his resume. You deserve it, my friend. James Beach. <laughs> 